Hey everyone, I'm Robin and in this video, I'm going to talk about the two pro best shops games on the Wii. Best pro shops this strike is decent, but I don't like the controls. They are so counterintuitive and annoying. And not only the controls are awful, but it seems that casting overhand sideways or underhand leads to the same result. The fishing part of the game works like you would expect. You watch your radar for fish, cast, change lures or boats, cast again, get into a fishing minigame, standard stuff. I can't say they added something on the mechanics, the game feels very familiar on the fishing part. As for game modes, you get career, quick fish and challenges, and some minigames. You get 10 locations to fish in, but the fishing itself is poorly executed in the game. I don't recommend it. Also the career mode is disappointing too. Before even entering a tournament, you need to earn reputation points. So before competing for free fishing, you need to free fish first. Which makes the career incredibly tedious and monotonous. Especially since the presentation is kinda boring and it takes forever to catch a fish. Also, the game came with a fishing hook. I haven't got the game with the hook, but people online complain that it works really poorly and you're better off playing the game with just the Wii modes. Still, if you like fishing and can get over the poor graphics and poor controls, the game is pretty fun and enjoyable. And Bass Pro Shops The Hunt, even if it sounds weird, is the same game as Bass Pro The Strike. You still roam around in a vehicle to find prey, you get occasional constraints like don't hunt that type of animal, the controls are great, but the graphics not so much. Peripherals aren't good, but still the game is ok if you play it with Wii modes. It's nice that the game puts you to hunt with multiple weapons. In this strike you had multiple lures, but the gameplay felt incredibly monotonous. Here it feels more varied, probably due to the animals looking more different. And due to the different weapons. You also get again mini games, and all in all the game is ok. It can get pretty boring, but it still can offer some decent amount of fun. So at the end it depends on you if you will like them or not. They both have some flaws, but I can't deny that the two games have a certain coziness to them, that attracts you to play more and more. Sure, they might not be top of the line, but they can set the mood for a relaxing lazy day. 